How long will it take to web enable a small database of about 200 tables? What about a large database with more than 1,000 tables? Days, weeks, months, or years? Our answer is 30 seconds with no coding, and in three different styles. We can access data through an action style URL. We can access data through a REST style URL. We can even access data in multiple databases through data browser. Watch. I'm going to use Pet Clinic database for the demo. Let me prepare the database first. Now we have a database. We can put it online with just a few keystrokes. First, unzip the scooter. Change its name to Clinic. Initialize the application, and then start up a web server. The web server is up. Let's go to the pet clinic page. Believe it or not, the pet clinic database is online now. We can access any data in the database from our browser. Let's first try the action style URLs. Which data do you want to see? A list of pets? Okay, not a problem. Let's view it online now. Just type controller slash action. That's it. Too many rows? Not a problem. Scooter has pagination. Okay, what else? A list of visits. Again, not a problem. Just type with this controller slash list action. We just use action style URLs to access our database. Now let's try rest style URLs. To do that, we need to turn on an auto rest property. That's easy. Just open the routes.property file, change the property, and save the file. That's it. Now let's see a list of paths through a REST style URL. Just type resource name paths. See, Scooter is very smart. It can automatically load configuration changes without restarting the web server. We can navigate to a linked record. Please note the URL is in REST style. We can edit a record. We can create a new record. And of course, we can delete a record. See, we have been doing all of this through RESTful URLs. Now, what if you want to access multiple databases? Not a problem. Scooter comes with a built-in tool called Data Browser. Just list your database information in a database property file. You can then browse through it. For example, we have three databases listed here. We can access all of them. The data browser allows us to access data in a RESTful way. It also provides convenient navigational links on each page. This is the first name we just updated. We can find its original value from a different database. This is the original value in the test database. Of course, we can update it. Now the value is in sync with the development database. 
In this demo, we saw the instant web enabling capabilities of Scooter Framework. We can put a database online instantly without coding. We can access data through either RESTful URLs or Action URLs. We can also access multiple databases through Data Browser. If you like Scooter, try it yourself and have fun. Mm -hmm.